What's going on guys, welcome back to another video. Today guys, I'm going to be showing you the new features that just came out in the brand new Premiere Pro CC 2018. So this is the new version that Adobe just released. So if you guys haven't already updated, be sure to go update. So to dive right into it, the first big change to Premiere Pro is the ability to open multiple projects at once. This is especially helpful as it gives you the ability to work on multiple projects at once. Meaning for movies, you can edit different scenes individually. It also gives you the ability to now copy and paste clips from one project to the other. The next big change is shared projects. Basically what this means is you and another editor can work on the same project together which is great for YouTube channels or movies that maybe have one guy doing sound design, one doing graphics, titles and effects, color grading and general editing. You can all work on it and it will be much faster for a group of editors. Next change is 8 new color tags. Now personally, I tend to not use these when editing, but for people that love all it to be clean and organised, then this is great for them. Now one of the biggest changes to Premiere this year is the advancement in 360 VR editing. One of the examples I saw is this new blur which just plays where the footage is black or is joining together. This blur is like way better than compared to the Gaussian blur, and I will insert a photo of that right now. Anyway guys, the last thing I'm going to mention is now Premiere has the ability to kind of have that ma magnetic timeline, just like Final Cut Pro, so basically to join clips back together. It used to be a really long process, and you just select them all, or just the clip you want to move. So now what you do is you select the clips you want it to be applied to, you go to Sequence, and then you click Close Gap, and that basically just magnetic timeline, and that kind of just closes the gap between the clips. Anyway guys, if I did miss any new features, be sure to drop a comment and I'll pin yours if it is the most descriptive and has the most features. Also guys, check out my Lightroom edition, which is a new Lightroom classic, new features. I just dropped that at the same time, so if you guys haven't already seen that, go check it out. Anyway guys, if you did enjoy, the, if you did enjoy this video, be sure to drop a like, share if you enjoyed, subscribe for you, and I'll see you guys in the next one.